Hey there, I'm Sarah from feedingyourfam.com where I love sharing simple and delicious recipes to help you with feeding your fam. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to make the most delicious hamburgers right in your cast iron skillet at home. I can't wait for you to try these. Let's get to it. Okay, I'm starting with about one pound of ground beef. Now, I like to use 80% lean, 20% fat. That extra fat will add so much moisture and a whole lot of flavor to these burgers. To this ground beef, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. So just go ahead and mix that Worcestershire sauce right into the ground beef. It will only take a few seconds. Okay, now we're ready to form our patties. That was it. So I want my burgers to be about three and a half ounces each. And I'm just gonna weigh them right here on my food scale until I get to th about three and a half ounces. And then you're just gonna form that right in between your hands. Just kind of flatten it out. Okay, there we go. Now we'll go ahead and form the rest. Now that our patties are all formed, I'm just gonna season them on both sides. I have some sea salt and some ground black pepper. You can just use regular salt if that's all that you have. I like the sea salt. We are gonna do this on both sides. Make sure you get plenty of seasoning on there. Flip them over and do it again on the other side. Okay, that is it. That is all the seasoning and prep we're gonna do on these hamburgers. Let's go ahead and get them in the cast iron now. So I've got my cast iron preheating over medium high heat. You want that pan to be nice and warm when we put those burgers in there. I mean hot, not warm, hot. If you feel like your cast iron needs a little bit more oil, just go ahead and drizzle some oil in there. You can use vegetable oil, avocado oil, just some olive oil. And then I like to just use a paper towel and just spread it all over the bottom of the pan, even up the sides. Okay, we are ready to get our burgers in there. Hear that sizzle? That's what you want. Okay, I'm gonna let these cook for about three to four minutes on each side. Now, I love to top my hamburgers with some grilled onions. So while our hamburgers are cooking in the cast iron pan, we're gonna go ahead and prep some of those onions to put right on top of those hamburgers. So I just have one yellow onion. I am just gonna slice off both ends. Slice it in half, peel off the outside. Then I'm just gonna slice those halves just into little slices. You want them a little thin, or at least that's how I like them. I guess if you want thick slices, you can cut thick slices. But I like thin slices. Then we're just gonna throw these into another pan with a little bit of butter and some salt, and they will go perfectly on top of our burgers. Now I'm gonna put about a tablespoon of butter into my second cast iron pan here. Just let that melt, and then I'm gonna throw those onions right into the pan. Just add a pinch of salt, let those cook down. It's been about three minutes. Let's give those burgers a flip. They're looking good. Burgers are done, the onions are done. Let's go ahead and get these into the buns. All right, I've got my bun. I've got my burger. Now, I like it pretty simple, just a little bit of mustard and ketchup. I'm not a mayo fan, nor do I like Miracle Whip, so don't give me a hard time, or do, if you want, I guess, but it's mustard and ketchup for me. Get that right onto the bun. And then I like a tomato, big green leafy lettuce, 
And then, of course, some pickles. You guys, I almost forgot my onions. After all that, how could I forget the onions? There is our delicious burger that we cooked right in our cast iron. They come out perfect every time. I hope you give this recipe a try. Don't forget to subscribe and like and follow along for more family-friendly recipes. I'll see you next time. Mm, I can't wait to dig in.